Here at KOCO, we love celebrating our teachers and the work they do, making sure that they know they are appreciated. KOCO and Quail Creek Bank want to highlight the amazing teachers here in the metro. And Chase Rutledge, you are at Esperanza Elementary there in Oklahoma City, about to surprise our October so Teacher of the Month. Take it away. <clears throat> I know it is that time. We've got all of his kids here behind me, and it's time to bring him in. He, uh, he doesn't know why we're here. He kind of saw us before, but now we're going to let him know why he's actually here. And this is Mr. Hemp Hill. If you'll come over here and join me. <laughs> Hi, I'm Chase Rutledge. I'm with uh, KOCO 5 News. Stay right here with me. <laughs> And uh, so we want to bring you in, and your wife actually nominated you, but you, believe it or not, you are our October Teacher of the Month. Oh my Congratulations. God. What do you guys think? <laughs> so your wife did, uh, come over here and let's get you both in the shot here. Your wife did nominate you, and uh, she said some really, really nice things about you. But uh, one of the things she said that you really love your students. Tell us a little bit about uh, your work ethic here at the school. Oh. Yes, well, uh, <laughs> well, we try to have fun. Uh, we try to stick to the rules. Uh, we try to uh, be safe, be responsible, be safe, um, like every day. Todos los días. So we're trying to really instill, uh, <laughs> try to instill, um, you know, a love of education. Yeah. And, uh, so and now, Kira, you nominated him, and one of the things that you told me was that when you wash his clothes, sometimes you find little notes from his students in there. Tell us a little bit about that. Yes. So anytime I'm washing his clothes, I'll look in his little pockets, and I'll find little flowers that the little kids give him, or there's little notes that say, I love you, Mr. Hemphill. Isn't that right, guys? Yeah. <laughs> and also check out his wrist. He, they make him bracelets. Thank you guys for the bracelets. Oh and he gosh. loves wearing them. So you told me that you had one student that uh, over fall break said that when he was gone, he was sad because he missed you. And then when he came back, he was happy. So they're clear. <laughs> Really happy to see you and they clearly love you. I was talking to them a little bit before you came in and uh, and they all love you so much. Oh wow, well yeah that's what we're going for really, a love yeah. of education. Well that's good. So we also know that you probably spend a little bit of your own money to, to help around the school. We want to help you out with that. We also want to uh, help you out with a little bit of money. Oh we gosh. have Erin wow. from, from wow. Quail Creek Thank Bank. You. Thank you very much. Thank you she very has a much. check for you for a thousand dollars for you to use on uh, donors oh, wow. choose for anything that you have here at the school. <laughs> wow. Well, today's dipping dots day. Could we uh yeah. You well, yeah, use it yeah, use it use it for what you want. What what do you think you could use this money for? Oh my gosh, books, paper, crayons, pencils. Um, I'll probably ask them to go shopping through a book or something, see if we can pick something out for the room. Yeah. Well that, that's a great idea. You, you could probably help him out a little bit too, can't you? I will. Oh that's gosh. good. That's wow. good. Well, congr congratulations. I mean, they appreciate you. We appreciate you. And I know what uh, Quail Creek Bank does. Uh, make sure that if you do have a teacher that you want to nominate so we can surprise them like we did Mr. Hemphill, <laughs> go to our website, nominate them, uh, and, and we'll do that next month. This is always exciting. Wow. Congratulations. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Thank you.